Back to Sounder Motors, Jay Lapp with you here. Uh, today I have a 41 foot fifth wheel for you. This is a grand design. Um, it is the Reflection model number 367 BHS. Uh, we've got four slides, we've got six point auto leveling system. We've got a lot of great options on this. Uh, first we're gonna open it up, uh, we'll walk you around the outside and then we'll take you inside and show you what we got. So let's get to it. design opened up. Uh, we're going to walk you around the outside, show you some of the features we have out here. Uh, we'll start here. Obviously, uh, here's the model number 367 VHS, but this does have the um, four season protection package on it. Um, so obviously four season camping is an option here. Uh, we've got great tread on the tires, we've got the aluminum wheels. Uh, this also has correct track um, stabilizing uh, and also auto alignment for the wheels. So that's great. Um, got the six-point leveling system. We'll show you the controls on the other side. Uh, outdoor storage. Got uh, exterior entertainment hookup here. Uh, we have a disconnect switch here in the pass-through storage. Lots of space in the pass-through storage. Got the tanks on this side and the other. And um, small tanks. Some more storage up front underneath the hitch. Got the battery in there. Nice fiberglass exterior on this trailer. Uh, no D-lamb. It's been kept in really good, really good condition. Here are all your hookups. You've got your city water, you've got your drains. Um, here is the auto leveling system, hydraulic leveling system, which is extremely handy, especially in a big trailer like this. Uh, just one touch and you are leveled. Uh, we've got the slide, bunkhouse slide. Kitchen, dining room, slide, bedroom slide up front. We'll show you that. Uh, power source in the back here is our plug-in. We've got the hitch, and then you have roof access. So that is the exterior. Uh, we're gonna take you inside and show you what we got. All right, come on up. Show you what we got inside the grand design here. So as you move, come into the trailer, um, mid entry point in the back, we've got rear living setup. So we've got a pull-out couch here in the very back, got a nice big window, got some good overhead storage uh, above the TV, above the back, above the stadium seating here. Um, but rear living, so we can pull out and sleep two here. Um, these two uh, chairs do recline, so you got the stadium seating there, the storage in the middle. Um, got a nice fireplace, more storage around it, got a smart TV in here. Got uh, Bluetooth set up up here, Bluetooth, DVD. Um, got USB hookup, auxiliary hookup, all of that. Like I said, fireplace. And then this moves into the kitchen and the dining room area. Got a nice big island, which will add storage. Got nice metal runners, deep drawers, stainless steel sink. Uh, we've got the three burner stove top with the oven um, again uh, because this is our slide out here we've got really deep drawers very functional uh, we've got the metal runners and they lock really nicely so they're not going anywhere uh, high quality cabinetry solid wood we're good there we've got the hood range we've got the uh, microwave another nice uh, this isn't a residential fridge it's actually the four-door upgraded fridge fantastic uh, for traveling, lots of space um, in the fridge itself. Got some drawers, 
down there, but then also two separate freezers here. So, got plenty of cold food storage as well as pantry for the dry food, which is awesome. A lot of space. Then even some more up top. Nice cabinet there, so space is definitely not lacking. Um, in the kitchen area, in the living area, got some nice pendant lights also. Uh, just a really sharp looking trailer all around. Uh, we do have a power vent powered right here, so the max fan. Um, you've got a thermostat for the back area here, and then you've got uh, another air conditioner heating unit up in the uh, master bedroom, which we will get to. Um, here in the hallway, so right when you come in, you've got your control panel. This has all your slides, it's got your tanks, um, it's got your lights, your um, water pump, water heater, all that stuff right there. And this, I love this layout, love these features, especially if you've got a family or you camp uh, with friends. You've got a completely private bunkhouse in here uh, or office space, uh, whatever you like. So this couch here, it folds down. It is also removable. Um, got plenty of space in here for a um, an air mattress if you like, uh, and then also we've still got storage. So again, more deep cabinet storage here at the drawers. You've got a desk, you've got TV hookup, all of that. Very functional. This is on a slide out. It's a nice deep slide out, so you've got lots of space in here. This is a great extra bonus room. Um, and then, as we do in RVs, we're utilizing all of the space. So up here in the hallway. You've got your ladder that stores in the wall, but uh, up here we've got a huge bunk area. Uh, you do have a vent up there. You've got um, storage up there. It's comfortable. It's got the uh, got the upgraded little mattress on here, so you are nice and comfortable up there. But easily sleep two, uh, maybe three kids up there. It's it's a great space. Um, nice big bathroom, got a pocket door, so that saves you some space. Um, but if you want to go in there and take a look, got a huge shower, got a sitting uh, seat in the shower there as well. Um, got the skylight for head space. But then to the left, you do have storage. You've got um, the vanity, got more storage underneath here. Got the drawers. Um, yeah, just a very functional layout. Then if we come up front, we've got a queen bed here. We've got extra storage underneath, but we got a queen bed. And this is on the slide as well, so that gives you extra space. You've got your second air conditioning unit here. We've got, uh, we've got wardrobe space here for drawers. We've got overhead space. The TV hookups are over here. Uh, huge closet in the front. If you wanna look at this, we've got shelving on the one side. You've got hanging here, and then we do have a washer dryer. Uh, combination unit to the side. Um, it is a again a very functional space, making use of everything that we can. Uh, but got plenty of uh, plenty of headroom here. A nice big closet, nice big bed. Just a great trailer. So again, recap: we've got a 2016 Grand Design Reflection 367 BHS. It is fully loaded, just under 15,000 pounds. Um, it's a great trailer. If you guys have any questions, give us a call at Souder Motors. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a great day.